A most difficult commute for so many along the western section of North Lake in Palm Beach County this morning. If you were caught up in it, even that description may not suffice. It was hours long waits for some people waiting to get to work and to school and so much more. It began with a serious accident near the Ibis and ancient tree communities. WPTV News Channel 5 story done and live with more Tori. Most people seem to know about the traffic congestion along North Lake in the early mornings and also during the evening commutes. And some people say what happened today is becoming more common. But in this case, North Lake was shut down for more than six hours. Raw emotions. Nobody can, can go to work. From hours and hours of standstill traffic. What was today like? Today was horrible. Normally a 20 minute commute was two hours today. And witnessing the aftermath of a wreck. We saw the helicopter. Involving a truck and a car early this morning near the ancient tree and Ibis developments. It was just awful to see. Firefighters say when they arrived, they had to extricate someone entrapped and someone was taken by Tomahawk to St. Mary's Medical Center. Palm Beach Gardens police tweeting out to avoid the area after a serious accident shut down all lanes of North Lake at Bay Hill Drive. People who live here say it points to a much bigger problem, the safety of this major roadway. The people just continually speed down North Lake. And the impact it has on their daily lives. I know that the increase in traffic is only gonna get worse because of those new communities going in. I don't know what's gonna happen. I mean, it's only two lane right now, North Lake. On, on either side. OK, I can skip one day, uh, whatever. <laughs> but, but if that happens, you know, often, of course, that's affect a, a lot because I have employees and, you know, if I'm not working, they're not working. And that affects, you know, more people than than only people who live in Acres. Yeah. Tori, again, working the story all day, still waiting on information from police about how many people were involved in the accident and their conditions.